Hey! No, we we're, 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 we're gonna we're gonna kill the soldier with some lights and it's gonna be fun times and Kai's gonna be up sneaking. 200 sneak, experience! Sneak, sneak, sneak. Way to go. So yeah, Makai is keeping Paragon until uh, Magic luck for uh, Makai level. Hi Makai level. Uh, exactly. I, I honestly I had really crappy uh, level ups this whole chapter because everyone's gonna get like two and none of them are good. And we're getting I, bad I was, levels. I was disappointed. What? Did you just do that? Did you see? It? What? It'll be okay. Um, it's like a sixty. Uh, fire! Nothing else can kill him though, besides fire. And there's no more fire to be had, so he's perfectly safe. Hey Torma, change sides. <laughs> hey Torma, change sides. <laughs> like, okay, dude. <laughs> Dead bully. I always, I always wait for these guys till the end. You really came to save us? Thank you. Oh, thank you. You have no idea how scared I've been. I don't even have eyes, man. You know how hard it is. I'm so glad I didn't Is give up. Anything? Anything? The earth goes to free us. Yay. Yeah. Perhaps you wouldn't have gotten caught if your helmet had eye slots. Just saying. It could have been generic if his helmet had eye slots. I don't trust that 93. I don't. Do you really? Come on, come on! I, well, I was having bad. I had all those bad luck for those 50 dodge with Soth and those crappy levels. I wasn't. I wasn't really on easy. On easy. You don't trust 93 on easy. I, don't. Wow. I do not. It's not like easy oh, changes. Said... Easy doesn't change the RNG. And I was having bad luck. Yes. See, yes. it's just uh, darn. Why, Edward? Matt. Let, let no one show you how to get a real luck. Defense, That's not a bad level up. You got defense. But I wanted more. Too bad. I want more. I'm playing FB10 on hardball right now. My Edward is level 15 swordmaster with 10 defense. You're being greedy. Well, uh, I want more. I'm not the strongest Jedi, but I should be. <laughs> <laughs> I had to watch that movie again for a film class. Which one? Episode three. Oh god. <laughs> And hey, Joe gets a kill. Awesome. Because I'm, I'm, I'm trying to make Jill useful. She doesn't seem to want to work, but like that. You got strength. Be fucking happy. <laughs> <laughs> it was strength or everything else but strength. Yeah, I was about to say, uh, literally in the last chapter, that was something that you said that a Jill level up was she would get strength and nothing else or everything else and not strength. <laughs> And then it happened. Life get. This Jill, man, that's just how she works. Oh, I don't like how she works. She used to get a new job. Second Vico, what the fuck? Yeah, I don't know. Hulk! But that was the only option that wouldn't get that guy killed, so. Quick, he's gonna get poisoned with herpes. Let him sit there and die. I'm gonna call you! I'm gonna call you! I'm gonna call you! Ooh. Oh, wow. He really got you. Cut me deep, oh my man. fuck, you got so much XP on easy, Jesus! <laughs> it cuts me deep, That's what man. I said. It's, it's, it's jarring after a while. <laughs> you know, I did two two runs of hard mode. One one before the okay, other. Okay, whoa. After mine, you got, when you go back, it's really whoa. jarring. Green dude, what are you doing? Running out. Obviously. Matt, this is why I don't. Release the green guy, so all the enemies. Are dead. I, I I don't think they attack them though. I've never seen one actually get attacked, so. They get attacked. Don't worry. Oh uh, well, then one's never been alive long enough. So it's suicide, Makaya. All right, woo. Let's do it. Hey. What? Wait. Hey. What are you doing? There we go. Hey, 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 Archer. It's time for some light reading. That was bad. Damn it, Ray! I do. You feel bad? I do. I feel. I feel bad for Ray. I feel bad because I had to read it myself. That LP has cursed me. <laughs> wow, Ray. Honestly, you should feel ashamed. Okay, Matt. For God's sake, talk to the goddamn mage. I'm going to. Like, let's get out of here, man. I have to make. Healing. I have to make sure Volu doesn't die. Like you die. Like a die. Hey, Tormod. Leo, what in blazes did you do, you, like, scurvy traitor? What are you talking about? You grew, like, tall man. 
Uh, I hope this doesn't affect fan relations between us. Like, man, it's important to me! But I'd really like to hear if I was the issue I see to look into. How did it go? Like, I have news to report, but, like, there's no time to chat and, like, wait, I'll tell you later, man! Hey, Drat. My name's not Drat, dude! <laughs> Suddenly they all converted. Yep. Okay. Don't you dare use Vika. I Don't do. you fucking dare. Don't you dare. I do. Don't you dare! Do Don't you dare! <laughs> no! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Self Told Cold here, and I'm gonna do the character profile for Vika. Now, Vika is a mixed bag. Because you see, Vika has decent base stats and really, really good growth, so it's really a toss up if you want to use her or not. The only problem I can see with her is that she comes in part 1 and then you don't get her back till part 4. So, unless you bring her levels up uh, quite a bit in part 1, training her in part 4 is going to be almost impossible and really not worth your time. Now, her base stats are pretty decent. She's got a lot of speed, which is a really good thing because, you know. <laughs> She doesn't have a lot of defense, so she's got to be dodging. And her strength is pretty low, but she has a decent. She has. She has. She doesn't have that good of a growth in it, but it'll still go up. So again, Vika's only real problem is that uh, it, it's her. It's her availability. She shows up in part one for like three chapters, and then you don't get her back until the end of the game. So it really is your choice. Also, she looks like a whore who has herpes, but that's beside the point. I wouldn't recommend using her, because I don't like having to train more than one character at the end of the game. Of <laughs> course, Naga! But, um, it, it's all up to you guys. You'll have to choose for yourself. <laughs> Damn, Trent. Back from the character to go to that. Yep. Uh, it, it actually probably kicked in before. Fire that door, Tormon. Oh god, why? You're fired, door. Oh. Why, god, why? <laughs> oh god. Thank you, I'm saved. I couldn't have held on any longer. Oh god. I'm going to make a run for it. I refuse to die in this pit of despair. I choose to live and return to my family. Can't believe you used Vika, man. I did. Why? And now, you know what? Hey. It's more arm time. Hey, it's right. <laughs> more arm fine. It's more Hey everybody, Omegas here, and we're going to be talking about Moiram. Uh, Moiram is the partner of Tormod, the Scooby to the Shaggy, so to speak. And together they run the Lagoos Emancipation Army in the first game, and in this game they are sort of an investigative unit type of figure. Anyways, um, Moiram has pretty great bases. He has actually very good bases, I would say, starting with like. 18 strength and, and you know pretty pretty good HP in defense. His growths are also pretty good supporting. Uh, the 16 HP, 55 in strength. The defense uh, a little bit lacking, but uh, I guess he does have luck as well, so that sort of helps his case. Um, uh, although he might look pretty good on paper, he does have uh, a bit of a problem, and it's the same problem that Torbot and Vika have, and that is availability. In a sense that, much like his partners, uh, at the end of part one, he's going to be going away. And you're not going to get him back until part four, and that is really sort of complicates things. And uh, because by that point, he's uh, your, your other characters are going to be, you know, a little bit higher, and you know, enemies are going to be harder and all that. Uh, he's not unusable by any means. In fact, I would argue that out of the three of them, uh, he's probably the easiest to catch back up to speed. And of course, that that is your own choice. But uh, off, for off my personal opinion, I can't recommend uh, that you use him in part four. Now, that's you know obviously your choice. You, you want to put in that effort to use him, you can. Again, I'd say he's probably the easiest of the three uh, to put back up. I'd argue he's slightly easier than Tor Mod, but I don't personally recommend it now. Warm time. It's time for some kitty. Dun 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 dun. Kitty. Warmer's like the best fucking game that isn't the Royal. Uh, I'm not crazy. You should read that F 10 LP I read, because that person actually did use Vika <laughs> in all the first chapter. Good man. <laughs> I said he did use her. Does something special happen if you use her in that chapter or something that I'm not aware of? Just did. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> it's about to be, be like I didn't know Vika and Opera had anything going on. This isn't a dream, I can read this miserable cage, oh, thank you, thank you, save my life, sexy shirtless man. Yeah.
Yep. <laughs> All right, man. That's <laughs> RNG. What's up? Just for feed the feed the blood to chill the blood knight. Blood for the blood god? Sure, why not? <laughs> well, maybe she actually gets any good luck. Kill, maim, burn, kill, maim, burn, etc. Duh. She didn't move over there. You're doing blood for the blood knight, so that means Jill is like a a corn berserker, and it's wonderful. <laughs> Edward, blah blah blah. Edward, I love your non beard. <laughs> <coughs> wow, Trent. That sounded way more sexual than it should have, even though you didn't mean it to. It was horribly sexual, Matt. <laughs> I meant every word. Oh, hey, look, an iron long. Ow. Oh, hey, look, Hal, for some reason, kicked in. <laughs> oh, man, that skill no one uses. Yeah. Hi, skill, how you doing? Don't quite know what's up with that, but so yeah, this, this one little transitioning area gets really cluttered really fast. There's gonna be dudes in the top left that spawn too. Hey. Maybe that's just normal and hard. Uh, I guess so, cause they come from the lower left. Yeah, I know that. Hey, wait, am I right when I say dude spawn in the top left? Yeah. Are they Is that an easy input too? Apparently not, cause they don't. Wait. Top left? No, 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 no. Cause I remember dudes in the top left. They come from the top right and the lower left. That's it. Hey guys, Mage Knight 404 here, and I'm going to talk to you about Tormod. He's the head of the Lugu's Emancipation Army, ordered by Sonic E2 to find out what's going on in Begneon. He's upbeat, cheery, peppy, all sorts of awesomeness. And he doesn't mind a good toasting of his enemies with his, cl with his Class A fire magic. He, he, since he's a fire sage, he's always got mastery of the, the one of the best types of magic in the game, fire magic as fire magic is both powerful and accurate. Plenty powerful. He also has great speed and all all right all around stats and very good growth for it for a ma for a magic user. He has one problem though. His lack of availability. One come part one once it's ending, he won't come back until very, very, very late in the game. By that time he's way behind everyone else. You'd have to put an astounding amount of effort into Tormod if you want him to get back onto his feet in time for the end game. That's, of course, your prerogative. Definitely use him in part one, although, all, and when part four rolls around, eh uh -huh, uh -huh. You better put your, you better put your socks on and hope that you can salvage this guy. Otherwise, don't even bother. At least on this one. I remember like two warriors running on the. I think it's two soldiers from the lower left and two mages in the top right. Uh, I think. Right then they did upgrade that in normal and hard. I wouldn't be surprised. Because in normal mode, in the top right there's four mages. Two in the top, two in the bottom. So yeah, let's class change Juliana. Mm -hmm. This will be enough, right? Nope. Ah! Ah! Oh! La di da game! So now I spend the rest of the level trying to get a Yana 2 experience. <laughs> this is a bad idea, man. This is a bad idea. That's why I don't do it. Hey, hey, this hey, is not a bad idea. I, I thought you said there were no more fire mages. Well, yeah, he doesn't move, so. Do it! Do it! Yes! I did do it. Because my arm can take the hit, so. My arm is a big kitty. Kitty! No, seriously, he's like the best Lagoon in the game that isn't a wall, but his availability is a piece of shit, and it kind of sucks. I think Volug is better. He's but not, availability. Though. It matters. What, what availability? Yeah, Volug's availability is just about as shitty as Morim's. No! No, not yeah. as. Not as shitty. Not as shitty, but it might as well be. Volug only chose the Dark Brigade chapters. Which is like, only half the game. Not really. Volug has got like three chapters in part three. Not that anybody okay. really cares, but you know. Like what? There's that one river crossing, and then... And then, okay, there's that one versus those people. And then... The defense one. The and that's it. Well, that, that's the one I'm talking about, the second yeah. one. And then there's... Three, 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 oh, wait, way to go more. I'm way, way to dodge that 60. It's one south. So yeah, you get like three chapters, so... That's oh, plenty. Oh man, Volo gets three more chapters than Morm does, oh man. That's plenty, man, it's plenty. Oh, you ran away. To die on the Jeez. battlefield another day. Here you go, no one. Have some power. Let's just put it this way, Matt. If Morm didn't have a strength cap, he'd get 80 strength. 
If he didn't have the strength cap. Keyword. He get 80. <laughs> no, I'm not even kidding. He really does. He gets 40 strength, and then when he transforms, he gets 80. I'm not even joking. That's a lot. That is way too much. <laughs> I'm not even Mordecai gets that much. Well, I don't think Mordecai is worth using in FE10, so... Mordecai's not worth using at all. I used him in FE9. He wasn't that bad. He was okay, but... Like, like here's the problem with Lagoos in FE9 and 10. In FE9, they got the transformation gauge right. But in FE10, they got the stats right. I but they couldn't combine them ever. Yeah, so, I, think they got, I think they got the stats wrong in FE10. No. Because, I mean, like, uh, the non rural Lagoosh's aren't really worth using. Mmm, yeah, but that's because of the transformation bar. Well, well with very rare... They have the FE9 like, transformation bar. I would use the goose all day long. Bleh. Well, they would. Wouldn't you, Ray? Sort of, but I would actually prefer their stats over the transformation gauge. Yeah. Well, if they had FE10 stats with FE9 transformation bar, would you use them all the time? Hell no! Why not? Because FE10 stats for the goose suck! A lot. No. Just, just doubling their stats, that just makes their, that just makes their human counterparts totally fail. I would like yeah, when they have, you know, survivability. <laughs> Just give them, just give them static basis bonuses to their stats when they transform. Nothing wrong with that. Whatever, man. Whatever, man. <laughs> yeah, I think you're alone on this trip. Sorry. I'll stay alone then. So, somebody, somebody in the comments will. Agree. Somebody in the comments will kiss your ass. <laughs> Ron. <laughs> I got it. I'm offensive Asian stereotype. So yeah, as you'll notice, it's still cluttered. Yes, over there. Ray. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Super Mario Land. <laughs> Super fucking Mario Land. Chai Kingdom all day, every day. Nice. Ah, uh, fun. <laughs> we racist. We love it. <laughs> and Janet isn't even here yet. <laughs> hey, you got it this time! I did! You did! And I knew it was there this time. <laughs> That's the amazing Oh thing. man, Matt doesn't fuck up. What are the odds? It happens every now and then. Every now and then, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think Trent will be the Trent. most happy once he starts playing past easy. Trent, I did a good thing. For once. Yay! For once. <laughs> Only once. Only once. Everybody gets one! <laughs> The birth and clock. Oh, Jesus. What you have? Seven? You missed a coin, Matt! Uh, yeah. I guess I did. It's not the coin. The most important item in the game, man. Se it's it's a nice the goddess card without a coin. Serenos Forest only said there was a master seal here, so... No, they didn't. I'm looking at the map right now. Well, the walkthrough says... Oh, the walkthrough. Gotta go to the <laughs> Yeah, that's a nice there, buddy. Whatever, man! I always, I always miss these here conversations. You better miss the arm- you better not miss the arm scroll in the next chapter, Matt. Okay, so, so, when we record the next chapter, remind me not to miss the arm scroll. Oh, you mean when you record these videos pre-recorded and then send them over, remind you not to miss them in the past? Yes. How exactly. You know what, man? Like, whatever, man. Like, okay, man. Like, fuck. Okay. Okay. Ah, no, you should use the other arm. Okay. Get serious. You, you like Terry Bogart too much, right? Okay. He really does. You did. Buster Wolf. Now, now's when you do it, Ray. Oh, wait. <laughs> right now. Yay. That's a bad idea. But guess what? Let's do it! I'll break both your arms! <laughs> I'm all ridiculous! All you pigs are today when we are asleep so you die to just today! What they have, swine or freedom, swine or have you been kept to it? They're eating her! Then they're gonna eat me! <laughs> oh my god! Ah, <laughs> uh, way to go, Trent. Yeah, really. 
This is the session where Trent screams. Oh, Ow. Ow, oh, my Micaiah. Really did break both of her arms. Hey, strength. Yes, yeah, it's me. What the fuck? <laughs> See, it's worth it after all. Christmas came early. Didn't forget it. <laughs> hey! Quick! <laughs> You're fired, man! <laughs> You're fired! Why am I fired? Oh, fuck. What did I do? Fucking. Ah! I, I told you, dude. Me and the RNG guys, we have a love hate relationship, okay? We, 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 get, we have problems, but then we have makeup sex, and it comes later, and it's, it happens, okay? <laughs> Oh fuck. Oh I'm fucking forget it. <laughs> now this is how to kill something, Aaron. This is man. this is how to have speed. Wait to speed man! His base is fucking twenty-two, like seriously man. Super healing. What are you doing, Tormod? You should not be using Micaiah, because in two chapters she's gonna get her own chapter to kill shit with.